my name is Dina, and I'm currently studying at Lehman University, and I'm an English major. Um, for me, I don't have a problem reading in Chinese, but however, if you want me to write maybe a formal statement in Chinese, then I would find it difficult because we never learned Chinese in um, such a high level. My name is Ninad and I study BBA year one. I think the government is not doing enough for the ethnic minor minorities to uh, for the Chinese language curriculum. Um, when I was in secondary one to three, we had um, simple Chinese classes, but all our sentences are very simple. It's kind of equivalent to maybe like primary school standard. We had to take uh, GCSE, but then um, that exam for Chinese is very, very easy. Um, it's really like primary school level. So I think it was kind of too easy for us, so it wasn't really challenging enough. And I think because after Form 4 to Form 6, we don't take any more Chinese lessons. I can say that the government should have done enough to make like maybe um, a easier Chinese curriculum for non-Chinese students. The, the Chinese companies, they could, uh, they could also give us a chance by hiring us and uh, looking at our performance. Because I think they're kind of biased towards the, uh, their own countrymen and not, not us because they kind of look down on us. So we also have right to, to get employed in public services, but uh, this kind of things like having a Chinese exam, which is testing our ability, it's, it kind of disadvantages from the others, because we may also have the ability, but just because of uh, this language, it may hinder us from getting into government services. Like the government is like are the people who give us that syllabus to study when we were younger and then you can't expect us to know another level of Chinese when we're older. When I was younger there was a lot of discrimination because um, I think Hong Kong back then they didn't have a mindset that um, other people also live in Hong Kong. Sometimes while playing football uh, with the Chinese people in uh, in in my at, at near my home, uh, when we win the matches, they discriminate discriminate us, calling us uh, some names. If people make fun of me or something, I would just like tell my teacher, and then my teacher would uh, help me like solve it but then like when I was older I could start speaking for myself so I would tell people if I'm offended when they call me something or say something. I think I would stay in Hong Kong because I was born here and I really like it over here. Um, yeah so I think I would continue my career in Hong Kong unless I have better opportunities overseas. Uh, it's, it's not yet decided it depends four years later how how things are gonna be.